Hello guys and uh, welcome to another episode of the France campaign here in Empire Total War. Uh, it's been about a week now since I have played, so... Um, but you know, I remember the basics of it all, I just don't really remember how long it is, how long it is since we were doing stuff. So, uh, for example, London. Can we move out of London now? How angry are they? Nah, still looks like we have to chill a bit. That's right. That's fine. The English will die when the time comes. Still got these annoying Hanoverians uh, gathering at my borders. Yeah, they really hate me. Why exactly are they so... Territorial expansions. That's starting to make a difference now. Yeah. Wow, that is really... Making a difference. Minus... Well, I guess the fact that we have an alliance is counteracting it, but yeah. The fact that we're taking more and more territories is making the rest of Europe hate us more and more. So I assume a... An alliance with these guys... Actually, we can do that now, for some reason? Oh, you're no longer allied to the British. Uh, I don't think I can afford it now. But uh, at some point we will want to work on that alliance. Let's see here, uh, the money situation could be could be better though. So we'll see. If they do not declare war on me, uh, like now, then I'll see about actually getting an alliance from them. Uh, well, I mean, it's not guaranteed, of course. We still have to pay a lot of money if uh, it's at all going to be possible. So, anyways, uh, this army, yeah, we'll just let it reinforce. We need to go down here and t retake Dutch Guyana. So. I think we'll just end a turn. It looks like we've done any, everything we can do in this one. Yeah, so I'll see you in the next turn. Unless something happens. Alright, hey, finally. Ah, uh, of course he's going to be in some useless place where he's not needed. Because that is how it is with agents in these in this game. Uh, I guess we'll plop him down in Flanders. This place is reasonably Catholic at this point. Uh, not bad Catholic, actually, so... Probably wouldn't hurt... Well, I don't know. I still want a Catholo Catholic... 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 Yeah, I can't speak. Catholic... I don't know. No, I, I don't know. <laughs> I want to make the place Catholic, that's what I'm trying to say. Uh, sort of. Just failing a bit at it. Sorry, I'm readjusting the microphone sound a bit. I don't think that should impact the recording though. It's just how much do I hear myself in my own headphones. Because talking without hearing yourself is just not very good. So we just got a new town in England, that's not super useful. Um, the only thing that would be useful is plopping up another happiness building. We could do that. We should probably do that. Only plus two happiness, but that's still not nothing to scoff at. Uh, we'll, you know, probably demolish them a bit later and you know replace them with uh, buildings that are focused on industry instead. Why is there smoke here? What's burning? Oh, it's just the the uh, the cannon thing doing its thing. Alright, let's see. Can we move uh, move away from Williamsburg? Or did we just sort of take this? I see I have not put them to rec or retraining, so that's a that's one thing at least. I guess a minus two happiness. What if I take one idiot out of this place? Yep, that's doable. Can I take both out of it? No. Uh, okay, well, maybe we can just switch troops down here and then we'll take you. Yep, they're fine with that, so you go there, you go there, that makes them happy, and then we take this army, and march down to Charleston. Now, I don't know whether or not this army is actually going to be... Oh yeah, no, it's... well, that's not a joke, but... Um, well, I don't know, we'll try. It's not the end of the world if we fuck up somehow. Uh, another, really th uh, another thing that I really want to do is to take down this place, because if we do that, we'll be able to permanently exterminate the uh, Iroquois faction which would be nice alright so yeah the only Cherokee armies are here how far can this army march anyways that will be two turns to get to that place I might just leave a garrison actually and then well they do have a lot of those mm, probably wouldn't be that great now let's just wait for retraining and stuff like that uh, there is no real reason to rush too much. Guess we can upgrade that. And let's actually fix this thing. It's been <laughs> destroyed forever. I think the threat to it is not as big anymore. 
Next we'll get a fur thing up. My gut tells me though that there are more important things to build and I'm just not focusing right. Can we... No, of course we can't retrain in our own territory. That would be dumb. So let's us get some units here. Sadly I cannot get those awesome axe people. That sucks. Uh, how's the artillery? Oh, we got artillery. You really just need some more line infantry, but you can't really recruit that here, which sucks balls. You have to get this uber building to get that. Well, let's do just some native muskets then. And what? Oh, what? Don't we have division of labor? Or are we working on that? No, we have a division of labor. What are you talking about, game? Why? Oh, we're poor. That's what <laughs> that would explain it. Yeah. All right then. Let's take a look at this army. This should be yeah. It's done re retraining now. Let's see. Can the entire thing move out? Um, no. No, no, I can't. Well, one have one dude has to stay. That's fine. Like, so is militia crap. Drop, Anavar. Indeed, my good French dipshit. All right. So is the agent on the boat? Because he should be. There you go. All right. Let's go to. Uh, although it would be tempting to go take the Leeward Islands first, because I think that that's. That would be the last pirate uh, place entirely, which would exterminate the pirate faction. But no, I say we go for Dutch Guiana. I want to. Uh, I want to be able to completely destroy the Iroquois Confederacy, and I need to take every last province if I am to do that. So <laughs> there was actually a trade ship in that fleet. That's interesting. Okay, uh, I say we end another turn, save a bit money maybe, and uh, see if we can pay the Hanoverians into peace and happiness and stuff. Would be nice to be able to take some of these troops and send them elsewhere. Not those troops, these troops. Well, I assume you understood that. So let's end the turn. Alright, uh, so look at this, the Polish-Lithuanian uh, Commonwealth is uh, fighting back. In the previous turn they took over Königsberg and now they're working... Well, they just took Gdansk and Breslau. So they've taken over all of the Prussian region and Silesia. So very interesting. Also, the Spanish moved an army over here. So I assume they're going for Algiers because they're still at war with the, uh, the Spanish, aren't they? Yeah. Good. Uh, so hopefully they'll take Algeria so I won't have to. Although I would kind of like controlling that province because it's historic and all that, but, you know, it's not really historic for this time period, so it's not a big deal. Right, got some of those muskets, good, good, good. Um, I don't know, let's just get some more troops, I guess. Dragoons. That works. Now, why am I not retraining these guys? Am I stupid or something? Am I dumb? Let's see, pikemen, can you also move out? Good. Actually, let's just take the entire army and start moving southwards, Marche! because that seems to be a possibility at this point. Yeah. And these dragoons. Yep, there we go. Join up as well. So now we'll definitely have big enough of an army to go beat up Charleston. Now I... You know what, let's actually just plop it back here. Let's look at big army going. Even start some retraining. All right. Uh, so this building is not done yet, meaning that I don't know if we should move out. I don't know how many troops we would even be able to move out. Uh, we can move the majority out. So actually, let's start marching. Destroy those guys. Wow, we took some losses. That's not very good. Them out of that place. And do some retraining. And we'll just chill here. And then we'll start marching over here. They might try and go around though, so we might have to head back, but that's okay. Because we have a Dankef army here. Wow, did they really just burn this down? Go, they just surrendered. They didn't even bother building any troops. But yeah, they've been just tearing this entire place down. That's stupid. Uh, let's get a trade fleet. I mean, trade navy, trade port. Yeah. 
Which again, good, good, good. All right, uh, tear this down. Now, how pagan is this at this point? Not very. So, can we just like move out immediately? It's like our religion and stuff. So. Really? I don't even have to retrain. Okay, fine, we'll stay like, a bit, I guess. Do some recruitment. Or not, because we don't have a building. Well, we'll recruit some over here then, because we can get some sweet uh, axemen down there. So, I might even just not upgrade that building, because I want to have those units. Is that stupid? Maybe. Anyways, I really do want to start moving out here, though. I mean, for God's sake, we, we need to be ready to... Well, we are getting closer, but what we can actually do is get a bit of a garrison going. Yeah, just get some militia that will disband later. Um, yeah. Yap. So yeah, we'll build up some troops, garrison the place, and then we'll start marching. Damn it, I thought this place was burning. Now it is. Good. Also, I noticed in the previous turn ending that we have a priest who wants to cross. So let us help him do just that. And this land shall be Catholic. Yep, now it's growing. Even if they have this annoying agent of their own here. Actually, that's what we should do. This guy should go south and work on killing him. Can't be having those wrong religion dipshits roaming about now, can we? No, of course we cannot. Not too poor to fix all the things they destroyed, but we will have an opportunity to do that at some point, I'm sure. Okay then, um, let's actually send this navy back over to this place and we'll pick up that unit of that we had to leave, because surely they'll be happy enough at this point. And another turn. A suspicious death. No! I killed my oui. idiot. You scumbag. Oh, of course now they're happy. Well, I'll still have to put them there. I guess we can bring ourselves a... Oh, for fuck's sake, I didn't mean for you to go there. Oh well. Go to this army. Let's start marching north. Uh, this guy will go down here and try and kill this guy. He didn't pull it off. You are blocked. What do you mean? Well, who cares? March south! I don't even care if you're not properly replenished. Some pirate... Recruitment. Probably hurts the income. Yep, 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 it does. Right, now let's go talk to Hanover. Let's see if they want to ally me. Let's pay them all the monies. Like so. Give them nothing. And try. Give Corsica. Hmm. That is tempting. Is Corsica a a thing? I guess I'll have to refuse for now. I need to check if Cors like is Corsica th something I need to own by the end of the game. Uh, Corsica is indeed something I need to own, so I guess it wouldn't be that brilliant to take it. Although I don't know, I'm kind of I kind of still want to do that. So let's try that again. <laughs> Just because it would relieve a lot of those forces that are stuck in Amsterdam right now. Hopefully, anyways. They might just turn on me immediately, but... Uh, but yeah, I, I like this, actually. Because I want to secure that border. We have traded Corsica before, we can trade it again. And we have to, we'll have to attack Genoa at some point near the end of the game, so... It's not like we're not gonna... I mean, we're gonna have to plop an army down there at some point, so... Yeah. Despite the stupidity of it all. We'll do that. So we just gave up Corsica. Uh, <laughs> uh, Corsica is not super valuable, is it? It did its purpose. It helped us out take Savoy, which is the one I wanted. So that's fine. It's a bit stupid, of course. But now we have an alliance with Hanover. Uh, 
How does that impact public or relations? Still unfriendly. Historical grievances. Yeah, we'll have to see. I don't know what we can do here to potentially improve it. Am I trying to give them a state gift? I don't know exactly how that would impact thing, things, but yeah. Hopefully they'll take this doom stack and like fuck off at this point. That would be good. I, are you even fighting anyone? No. Well, you're fighting Sweden. So why on earth? I mean, you border Sweden. Why exactly are you not marching on Copenhagen? That's what I need to know. Speaking of Sweden, I think we can trade with them. Though, uh, okay, we're already trading with Hanover. <laughs> we can actually trade with the Barbary states. That's sort of hilarious. I'm going to prioritize Sweden though. Oh, come on, Sweden. What if I pay you monies? Sweet, sweet monies. Damn it. All right. Let's trade with the Barber States then. Really? Well, okay. This mutually beneficial trade is just not... It's not their thing, is it? You know? They just don't like it. Sad thing. All right. Let's get this navy over here. I'm sure you can move out. I should have actually recruited a unit. That would, that would not have been too stupid. Of course, I did not do that. Oh well. And then we'll start heading back. Uh, yeah, let's recruit... Oh, that's right. We could not recruit anything there. But we could recruit here. Now, he'll be there next turn. So I'm not going to recruit. I'm not going to recruit anymore. That will be it for now. And then they are indeed marching, but they are like bringing no one, so I think we can actually hold this place with just those troops. Lancers, I mean those medicine men, are, they are kind of scary. I don't know if militia, I don't know who would win. Although actually we can, maybe, well, probably couldn't just take it right now, could we? No, but we can lay siege. I'm still not super happy about this battle. You know what? Let us actually cross. We can't do that. Ah, oh well. Just well, that sucks. We will end another turn. All right, so we are getting attacked now, um, and we can't actually retreat. Okay, well, I guess we'll have to fight then. Well, let's hope this works out. Please don't charge me, although, let's actually just stand like that. Because these guys don't have any guns, so... Ah, of course you're going to waste your armor on him. Shoot the Lancers, damn it! Shoot them! What are you doing? Just want to shuffle a bit. Just, you know, take your time. That's, that's, that's okay too. Yeah, just don't don't shoot, you know. Just 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 decide not to. Fuck's sake. For fuck sake indeed. All right. Uh fuck. <laughs> I'm about to say I I wonder have I unlocked fire by rank because I cannot remember. I remember last time I um got confused about what technology I have. I got some angriness in the comments. So <laughs> I'm a bit scared to fuck up again. Please shoot. Or you can just take your time as well. You know. Seems to be a thing. Damn it. Yeah. Well, I shouldn't be complaining. Despite I despite me feeling I have a right to. Okay, so they're just gonna run away immediately. That's good. Let's so musket men, musket men, medicine men. Yeah, so let's see if I have fire bar rank. It does not look like it. Okay, good. Or not good, but or it might just be that colonial infantry can't fire by rank. I am not entirely sure about that actually. I am not going to loy. Alright, let's get try and get these guys behind the lines a bit. Well, at least this unit. So that it I can actually achieve something. Spit up here, see if I can shoot over these. Um, although this is not good. Uh, might just have to charge in here. Okay, 
we need some flanking, that's how we're gonna win this. Okay, so those medicine men are gonna slaughter my poor, poor, uh... You know what, let's just go for the ch Well, actually, now they just re redecided. okay. Okay, so they just did something. Let's get these guys back, purely for the morale. Let's even work on these guys. Because my guys are probably struggling a bit, because they're actually getting surrounded. Which is usually what I like to do. Okay, so these are... what now? Okay, those are just X-Men. Let's see if we can get around here. Are these guys even shooting? Yeah, they are. That's nice. Okay, so some people are running away, and now we're getting attacked. Not good. Well, charge! Let's get these guys around. Alright, so they're really just running away. <laughs> yeah, it's just, uh, you know... Arm. It's just like those militia guys that I have, so they're not really the best units, are they? So the medicine men are going in for the charge, that's not very good. Oh, these are musket men, actually. Alright, so their general just died. I don't know exactly where and how and etc, but at the end of the day, it doesn't really matter. Because he dead. I'm just a bit worried that we're not going to kill as many as I would prefer mean that the battle that will come after this, or I don't know, maybe they cannot hold out a siege very long. I'll have to see. But my men held out really well though, so I'll give them that. Now let's get these men in some sort of position to shoot out these musket men. Hopefully they'll run away. I think I want to use my cavalry for chasing down the enemy dipshits. I will indeed do just that. Right, let's see here. Is it not a very good line of sight, but looks like it does the trick. These guys should... What is it called? Wreak some havoc? They should wreck them, at least. That's what I'm trying to say. Yeah, they're wavering. And they run away. Okay, victory or not, because... Ah, uh, never mind, those guys are running. No, oh, no, everyone's running. Alright, see you on the cafe map. And it is a victory! Glorious! So we should be able to take that settlement in the next turn and that should... Oh, there we go. So this is why I wanted to ally them. So now they are indeed marching away from me and going to beat up the Swedes. Uh, and I mean, I guess that's good for me, you know. I'll get a trading partner controlling the Scandinavian territories rather than a... just bitch who doesn't want to trade with me. Agent detected. Is, it, is there someone? Yeah, it's this dipshit. He's trying to kill my people. New England Blizzard. Okay. That's whatever. Now, let's see if we can get this guy killed. Yes! Very good. So that'll make this guy survive. Not that he is any good. I guess he'll, he's worth saving. Probably. Alright, so let's just auto-resolve this, or maybe they'll just give up now. Alright, auto-resolve it is then. Actually, I probably could have just waited there, but, uh, oh well. Not a big that'll that at least got rid of that little uh, problem. Okay, so now we only need one more territory, and we will be able to integrate uh, Louisiana, which will be very nice. And my god, they have indeed upgraded these things. Well, I guess they have to spend their money on something. So that's fine by me. Alright, tear that shit down, and now we, we will reinforce. Um, yeah, I think this will be the next. We need to deal with both uh, Rupert's Land and the Huron Factory. Or Huron Factory? <laughs> Huron Territory. Uh, and we'll have to hope that the Cherokee does not immediately invade me. For some reason we're not allowed to trade despite really bordering each other. Do not know what's up with that. We will. Let's go take down Carolina. So, at least once Carolina is done, we'll have a um, an army that we can use to beat down the Cherokee. So that'll be nice. I'll probably go straight for... What is it? What is it? I think it's the Cheroko, Cherokee territory itself that I need to get it integrated. Cherokee territory? Yes, it is that indeed. So once we take this, uh, we'll gain Louisiana. Probably the most underwhelming of all of the 
colonial nations, but that's fine. Now I wonder, can we make peaceful relations with the um, the Pueblo? Because that I want. Shit, I wouldn't really, I wouldn't even mind an alliance. No, he's not into it. Oh well. Uh, because I will, I don't necessarily want to conquer him. I'm not a huge fan of having a border with the Spanish, but I guess we already have enough of a border, so probably we might just want to conquer Texas. Probably leave the uh, Plains Nations alone, though. Anyways, now that we have this army freed up, we can finally go do something with it, and I don't really know what we're going to do. Also, we need to figure out how, exactly how many troops we can take out of this town. Nous ne faire cela, oh wow, yeah, these guys are kind of happy at this point, actually. Let's keep upgrading that church. Get that good old Catholicism spreading. Hey. Yeah. Ooh, grenadiers. Where can I do grenadiers? Can I do grenadiers? Yes. Fucking grenadiers. So very nice. Yeah, what? Yeah, let's uh, let's build up a new army here. Now these are drawn by horses, yes. So we want at least... Oh man, we can just get a crazy amount. Yeah, let's build up an army and we'll combine it with this thing and then we'll either go to India or we'll finish off the English or deal with any other situations that arise. Uh, because we do need to get to India at some point to actually complete the campaign. Right, this guy can move. Uh, do we just want to go straight? And my god, you are not very good at balancing your armies, I see. Well, let's use that to our advantage then. Oh man, our cannons are... Our cannons are going to have a good day. We have a lot of cannons though, my god. But yeah, let's uh, attack Edinburgh. Siege that shit out. I want them to attack me. Because does this place have castles? Yes. Or, uh, yeah, castles, forts, whatever. I'm not a fan of that. I do not want to repeat the madness that happened over in Amsterdam, so... I say we just do it like that. Um, now one thing is our lack of a navy to bring our idiots over to India. Let's actually get this navy. Yeah, I think we can just send all the ships. We'll try and get them around. It's going to take a while, but, you know. That'll give us some time to actually recruit more of a navy as well. Um, so here's one boat. And... Is that really all I have here in the north? I guess that's okay. So yeah, so we can get like 4th rate, Admiral flagship, 5th rate, 6th rate. Now, yeah, so le the less... the less rates, the better the boat. Let's actually get rid of one of the Grenadiers, see if that'll afford us a boat. Well, it gives us 6th rate, but I want me a 4th rate. How much is that? 2,000? Okay. Well. That you can, and then... No. Uh, no. I want I want a fourth rate. So, well, it's going to be a while until we can actually travel to India anyway, so that's fine. Yep, let's get a fourth rate going. I wouldn't mind just something over here as well. Sixth rate, that's also expensive. Although, nah, <laughs> I'm just ditching all of this. Not. Let's get a navy, for God's sake. Sixth rates, fourth rates, all the rates. And we shall go to India and conquer. Uh, but we are done now. Uh, I mean, yeah. Persia, trade. Uh, yeah, they actually will do it now. Good. So now we are going to earn some more money. Hey, look at that, 8,000. Very good. And another turn. Oh yeah, that's right, this army exists. Forgot about that. Oh well. Now, are the British going to attack me? No, they're just going to chill. That's also fine by me. And so, we now have a building here. So that'll definitely make us ready to move out, I'm sure. Pardon, Indeed. Are we taxing them? Nope. Well, that's okay. I should really look into some taxation, though. Uh, because I am, I've got a feeling I am ex exempting a lot of people from tax. No, oh, damn it! I want you to go onto the boats. Here we are. Monsieur, we will join up and we'll set sail onwards to the land of the Leeward Islands. 
Let's chill in this port and fix it up. Ah, yes. Ah, fire by rank. There we go. Brilliant. Now let's get a socket bayonet. Because I doubt the wedge formation is super important. Might be good though. I don't know. Campaign map. Ooh. That is actually more tempting. So what's going on over here? Well, we have action... Ceiling drill. Ooh, that is actually very nice. Let's get that. That will help me build up my farms and stuff. Well, what is this? Sepness, more research rate. Uh, what is this? Joint stock? Yeah. Can I attempt it to get... Sock bayonet instead. Oh, damn it, not you. Fuck. No, e that one. You. Hello. Mm. Separation of power. You. I guess we do want these things. We'll just have to continue building um, happiness buildings. Alright, so do we build a church here? Seems like they're okay with me, despite being the wrong religion. Let's upgrade that at least. Yeah, there's a lot of these places that need upgrading. Well, we definitely want to get that started. Let's build... So already some industrial stuff here. I don't know, let's get a church. We can dismantle it later. Burial grounds. Uh, that's fine for now. It doesn't convert anyone. So that's okay. Now, how many can we, you know, pull out of here? Almost everyone. So we'll have a... Let's actually leave an axe, dude. And we'll start heading up here to the Huron territory. We will want to do some recruitment here. Let's actually get some bowmen, just because I want to see how they work. Let's get a unit of cav here. Infrastructure, yeah, that would be useful. Get some better infrastructure going. Get that farm going. So that'll be that region. Alright, now then there's this army. The uh, Bavarians, or not Bavarians, uh, Hanoverians have yet to take uh, Copenhagen. So that's a thing, but they are indeed moving over there now, so that was very- I, I definitely feel selling away Corsica was worth that little trade. So let's chill in the capital. So this is the army as it stands now. Definitely won't want to be stronger than that. The boats still need time to recruit, so... And these guys need time to get over here, although I guess we'll- We, 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 we would be able to meet up with them when we go down, but that's fine, I guess. Let's get a, um, let's get a grenadier recruited. Yeah, that dropped our income. The income varies though, depends on how, you know, if enemy ports are blockaded and stuff like that. And this is a shitty army. Militia, cav, and citizen f people? Yep, not very good. Let's go down and see if we can kill this uh, priest of theirs. Ah, for fuck's sake, really? Ah, that sucks. Oh, well, we'll have to kill the agent by killing the entire yeah, British nation. That is also an option. Uh, however, I think we, this would be a nice place to end the episode. So uh, thanks so much for watching this episode, and until next time, bye.